So first up, I'll show you guys some images of different types of doubling that takes place on a 1995 penny. This is what you want to look for, doubling on all the lettering on the coin. Here's another example of that. And we're just gonna go through a couple examples there. You can see the Liberty is doubled as well. And we'll look at what some of these have actually sold for. Now the price on these pennies are going to vary based on the condition of the coin. And of course, when the coin is actually sold. This first one here is a 1995 double die penny. Now it's graded at a mint state 69. So it's a very, very high graded coin. Now this double die penny here sold for over $1,100. Now here's another penny that's also graded at a mint state 69. So very, very high grade here. Now this one here sold for over $5,000. $5,000 for this 1995 penny. Now here's an example of one that's graded at a mint state 68. It's sold for over $315. And then here's one that sold for over $490, also graded at a Mint State 68. Now let's put this underneath the scope and see what these double dies actually look like in person. So we're actually gonna search through all the 1995 pennies that I found in a box. Here is a double die, someone sent me this. This is awesome. So you guys can see that doubling on IN and then GOD and trust as well, especially on that T there. Now if we look down here at Liberty, you can see that it is doubled as well. You look at the L and the B, that's really noticeable, the E and the R. Really you can see doubling on all the letters, but it's really noticeable there on the L and the B and the E. So that is awesome. Thank you to whoever sent this. I forgot who sent it. It's been such a long time. But that is what you want to look for, and that's what we're going to search through right now. We're going to see if we can find any double dies ourselves. Now, these all did come out of the same box from the bank, so hopefully we can find something awesome, guys. And don't forget, if you guys haven't been keeping up with my videos, I've been doing collectible videos along with coin videos as well. Let me know what videos you guys want to see next. If there's any type of collectibles that you guys like that I haven't covered, and you guys want to see in future videos feel free to put it in the comments below that would be awesome now i do have about i don't know maybe we have a pretty good amount of pennies here that we'll search through all right I'm not seeing any double in there all right no double in there so if you guys want to see your coins up close like this all you guys got to do is get a usb coin microscope I do have them available on couchcollectibles.com. There we go, focus that thing all the way, there we go. I do have these available on couchcollectibles.com. Link is down in the comments and in the description of the video. Now, I did keep all the 1995 pennies. I separated all of them, no matter what their conditions were because I wanted to check all of them to see if I could find a double die in one box of pennies. Hey, you never know what you guys can find, guys. If you guys want to search coins like this, all you guys got to do is go to the bank. Ask the bank teller if you can get a box of pennies. She says that she don't have enough. Say, well, can I get $20 worth of pennies? Or, we'll say, can I get $10 worth of pennies? And uh, they'll most likely be able to give them to you. But if you guys want to get nickels, dimes, quarters, half dollars, you can just ask them, hey, do you have a box of nickels or a box of dimes? And if they don't, just ask them for, you know, 20 bucks worth or something like that. That way you can search through. Uh, at least something and then for half dollars if you go to the bank you can ask them if they have any half dollar rolls or if they have any loose half dollars and you can buy them from them for face value if they do have any now if you guys want a box of half dollars if they don't have any boxes you guys can ask them if they can order them for you and they most likely can do that I know my bank does both of my banks do I got two different banks and they both order them so just ask around at different banks and see if you guys can get those ordered and these double dies are not easy to find but this is what you got to search for if you guys haven't checked out my coin roll hunting uh show it's called coin roll hunters and episode one is already posted on my channel coin roll hunters episode one gonna do episode two very shortly so be looking out for that i really enjoyed making that video so Let's see if we can find anything. And if you guys haven't checked out the live streams that I do on my channel, be sure to go check those out. We have awesome live streams 
giveaway silver coins, free giveaways, all that good stuff. So don't forget to go check out the live streams. If you press the bell on my channel, it will notify you when I go live. That way you guys can know when I am live streaming. And the people that comment on my channel the most, the people that like my videos, it will notify you guys before anyone else. Sometimes some people don't get notified and it's because they're not really active on the channel. So keep that in mind. That's just kind of how YouTube works. Uh, kind of frustrating as a creator. So I don't know, maybe uh, maybe they'll change it eventually and start notifying more people. But uh, that's just something you gotta deal with and go with and uh, keep on uploading, upload, 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 and uh, you should be good. All right, here we go, another 95 penny. Not seeing any doubling. So this is about, I don't know, maybe a dollar's worth or something in pennies. Something along those lines. Uh, nope. All right. So this is super simple. I'm going to be uploading a lot more videos like this about pennies and showing you guys exactly what to look for. And we're going to be searching these underneath the scope like this to see if we can actually find them. So stay tuned for that. Be on the lookout for these penny videos. We're also going to be doing them on nickels. We're going to be looking for repunched mint marks, double dies, all that good stuff. So. Stay tuned for those videos. This is the last one, I believe, and no doubling. But like I said, guys, this is what you wanna look for. This is a great example. I mean, you cannot see this unless you put it underneath the microscope. Let me focus this a little more here. You cannot see this unless you put this underneath the microscope. I've looked at it and I cannot see it without the microscope, so. Be sure to get you a microscope couch collectibles dot Ah, all right, man. That's what you want to look for. You can see that doubling there. No doubling on the date, though. Just doubling on liberty and the phrase in God we trust. All right, guys. Until tomorrow, I will see you all in the comment section below. Subscribe in the middle. Check out the videos to the left of me. This is Couch Collectibles, and this is where I disappear.